unrestricted control, it is destructive. You know, over in India, those, um, what do they call them? Gurus? From India and Africa, did y'all know that they send water power against the United States? Did you know every hurricane comes from that way? It comes the same way? They sit, actually, there's, there's actually, they stand out on the water and they chant and thousands, they call thousands of spirits and stir the water up and send the hurricane. I know this is hard for y'all to believe. I mean, you know, it's hard for y'all to believe. I guess y'all need some special effects to get what I'm saying. But I'm telling you this stuff is real. And you better know this stuff is real because these powers I'm talking about, you're going to think they knew, and that's why people going to follow the Antichrist. He's going to be doing this stuff. The Bible says he's going to call fire from heaven. They're going to say, ooh, not realizing the demon, uh, witch has been doing that a long time. The whole point is that's the reason why the occult is the occult. It's hidden only because they're trying to fool you about the power in the end. If they was already doing the stuff, you would say, oh, that's the same power they was doing over. But they're going to hide it until the end, and they're going to come doing these powers and floating and stuff. You're going to think, oh, this is God. And people are going to be ready to give their allegiance and take the mark of the beast because of the power. The Bible says these lying, they say they're going to do lying wonders. Are y'all there? The problem is if you've ever been in India and Africa, you know they already do this stuff. They will float right in front of your face. They'll stand right there and float off the ground in front of your face. They'll disappear. Boom, be gone. Witches be flying. They'll fly on you. I remember, I remember, I'm serious, it's a video online right now. There was a witch, she was flying, she hit a, she hit a power line and got electrocuted and hit, they saw her fall out of, out of the earth. She was a bird and fall out of the ground, she was a woman. All her skin was burnt off because she hit electrical wire. I'm saying, you can look it up yourself, don't take my word for it. This stuff is already there. This is the reason why Satan has cut, Af cut you off from Africa because they already doing it in Africa. Africa already knows about this power, this ain't nothing new. But over here, we're, being, we're, 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 we're actually accepting it because we're being entertained by it, and we think this is good stuff. What we don't know, what they don't tell you, is how the people have to covenant their lives, their children, how you have to go into blood sacrifice and blood covenants in order to keep that power. And then when you die, you owe Satan your soul for whatever little power you was working with. And because we have a generation that's so rejected that literally would probably sell their soul to be famous, that they would actually do it anyway. Are y'all there? And so this is so 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 this is the power that we have to understand that is that that is it's not coming; it's already here. It's just going to be revealed. All right, let me get done. Now, what do water spirits do? Because I already told y'all they marry you. That's one thing they do. Another thing why the spirits are over is finance, money. The reason why is because most commerce is on the sea. Most commerce comes from the sea. Everything that we trade, the ships, the stuff that's shipped in from China, it all comes from the sea. They control that. They also control uh, 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 perversion. They also control fashion. This is the reason why I try to teach you about the queen of the coast. Most of the, the looks of these women come from the water kingdom. Most of the hairstyles are coming from her. The makeup, all coming from there. That's why women are just looking like goddesses and why are they trying to be so beautiful and what is all this for? Because these are the spirits that's running people. Y'all hear what I'm saying? The fashion, all the fashion has to be where your clothes is half off because the goal of water spirits was to catch uh, men in the sea by a bit like mermaids. I know y'all don't think it's real, but it's real. And so the men actually crashed their boats looking at this naked mermaid over her because they call sirens. Sirens is actually the offspring, of the daughters of the fallen angels. Y'all don't want to get that. Y'all don't get with that. Are y'all there? And so, and so, because the Bible says, I mean, the book of Enoch says the daughters of the fallen angels was going to be them sirens, the seducers of men. So they would seduce men to, to come and lie with them, and then all of a sudden they would capture those men, so they would drown them. And, and they do know that that's what, that, that, that one of the biggest kingdom is in the Bermuda Triangle. They know, they've been knowing that. And that's why you always see boats and stuff come up missing over there. Are you hearing what I'm saying? I, I, know, I, know, I know it's hard for y'all to believe, but the, the revelations of this stuff is already out. And I'm trying to tell y'all that you don't know everything. As a matter of fact, you might not know anything because your education system dumbed you down from everything. All you know is enough knowledge to be ignorant. 
you really do, you know enough to be ignorant because if I was to talk to you, you wouldn't, you heard nothing of what I'm saying in school. And, I, and I, what I'm telling you is what you're really dealing with. That's why you never learned nothing in school to help your life. Once you learn to read, that was about all you learned. Read and count, you straight. What else did you use? <laughs> Trigonometry, what else did you use? Calculus, what, what did you use? You use nothing else but reading and writing. Are y'all there? Now, so, say fashion. fashion. Now, one, one of the things I learned was many people, are, many people have generational curses. That means uh, your, your, your mother, your father, your grandmother, your grandfather um, worshipped idols. They might have worshipped these spirits. And, 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 and the way they worship these spirits, sometimes they worship them with, all, with, 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 with food, with gifts. gifts on a, if, if you've ever been in people's houses and you've seen altars, candles on altars, then you the, the, get out. Get out. If you if ever, I mean, this is, this is real. If, if you've ever been in one of what they call all white churches, not white people, but they got white garments on, those are, those, those are water spirit churches. Water spirits like white. And if you ever been in one of them, and that's what, and, and black people, we do that stuff all the time. We don't even know what we're doing, but that's, but that's actually worship to the, to the water kingdom. Are you understanding what I'm saying? If you, if you, um, um, but, 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 but going back to how they worship, uh, if you, if you ever seen, uh, uh, now, voodoo spirits and water spirits are really the same. We're talking about the same stuff. It's just different names, but it's usually the same thing. Now, now, when you see these altars in people's houses, now, 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 now people that are just uh, casual worshipers, they'll worship them with just putting food on the altar, maybe lighting a candle, maybe doing some type of um, drink, pour out offering, a drink offering, something like that. But those that are deeper worship them with killing chickens and chicken bloods and different things. And if they get too deep, they go into that black dark that dark witchcraft, and they get into human sacrifice and, and stuff like that. But that's the, but the open door comes through just plain ancestor worship. The problem with us is that's on our life, and you see more and more people into ancestor worship. And, and ancestor worship is worship of wild spirits. They usually worship in the queen of the coast, or they worship in a, a, a serpent or something like that. Uh, uh, but, but, but that. But that ancestor worship is really passed down. That's a curse on the black race. That's a curse on our race. And so, and, so, and, and so this is real prevalent. And so what happens is once a person that worshiped those spirits die, the spirits come down to the next person. Yeah. They go down to the bloodline. This is why I told you that if you, that, 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 that it's very important that you break the curses on your life because if you don't, those spirits come to your child. Yeah. The Bible says the parents eat sour grapes, but the children's teeth are set on ears. That means what you was into, your child will fight it if you don't fight it. That's why fornication spirit come down to the next generation. It just comes down. The, the children born out of way a lot come right on down. You want to know why is everybody doing the same thing? Because that spirit just jumps to the next generation and jumps to the next generation. And then the one that actually breaks the curse and gets saved and begins to plead the blood, they go through more attacks. The whole family hate them. You know why the whole family hate you? Because you are the one. Them demons in the family turn against you because now you are the one that broke the curse. The spirit say, I can't come no more. I, I ain't got no more people after this. How dare you? I've been in this family for 200, 300 years. And now you broke the cycle. And so this spirit stir up everybody against you. You be wondering, why am I, if I'm doing right, why am I going through so much? It's because you broke that curse. And now your children, uh, your, that spirit cannot come to your children because you broke the rights of it in your life by the blood of Jesus. Right, y'all, come on, y'all hearing what I'm saying? Uh, if 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 a, if if a, uh, if a father, now, now, now listen. Let me let me let me let me go a little deeper. Can I go a little deeper? Um, the marine kingdom is a very sexual kingdom. Most of the dances come from there. I'm making statements. You, you, I don't care if you believe it or not. I'm just making statements. Matter of fact, if you go look up, study Michael Jackson, he'll tell you where he got this music from. You, the music comes from the marine kingdom. One of, the, one, one of the operations of the kings in the marine kingdom is to keep their subjects dancing. They dance, 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 dance. 
and, 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 and in that comes music, and they use people that are under their covenants and curses to channel the music and some of the music you're listening to. That's why all of it's demonic and wicked and evil and very, very sensual and sexual because it's coming from a sensual, sexual place. And the greatest entertainers and stars you see are the ones that channel that stuff the best. So don't think Beyonce, she's not talented. She's just a good channeler. Jay-Z ain't talented. He just knows how to shut down his mind and let that demon begin to manifest in him. Same way with Lil Wayne and all the other greats that you think are great. They are channelers. The, your celebrities are channelers. And the more, the more they channel, the more the, they give themselves over to them spirits, the more famous and the more money they'll make. Have you ever wondered how is Kim Kardashian, who ain't got no talent, but yes, she's famous because she gave herself over to them spirits. And even though she does nothing, they can manifest their, their pride and their, and their beauty and all of that uh, a pop and all that through her. And so they're going to use her until, because she probably got covenants from her family anyway. But I'm trying to show y'all, don't get caught up in this stuff. Fame is about being in connection with Satan. And everybody that's truly famous, that's why Nicki Minaj was telling y'all, I got this demon in me, see, and this demon Roman. Why is, it, why is she famous? Because she got that spirit in her. That spirit is what's manifesting. Well, see, that's the reason why if you ever heard, go back and look at some of these videos on YouTube about behind rock and roll, and you listen to how these people get up and they start talking, and they say, when we took the stage and we get up there and we get to playing, all of a sudden, something else is playing. We back, it's almost like we step out of ourselves, and we just doing it, we don't know how we doing it, and we're afraid to ask what spirit it is. Are y'all hearing what I'm saying? All of a sudden, if you go back, especially in the, in the rock era, you start listening to those lyrics of them songs, you'll find out all of them songs were Satan. They were channeling, they were channeling them songs. But now Satan is crafty. He knows he's not going to channel straight satanic stuff, so he's using them to channel lust. Most of the artists are channeling lust, and the rappers are channeling murder. Are y'all hearing what I'm saying? Come on, talk to me. And so you thinking they good, and they, they, they smart, and they wise, and they famous. And matter of fact, what do they call them? Geniuses. They call them geniuses. The greater, the more channel they can channel, the greater, the, 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 the greater awards they get. Are y'all hearing what I'm saying? But them people will tell you that's why they, they drank themselves to death, they commit suicide, they die early. Why? Because they are tormented by the very spirit that's giving them the genius. Because demons must be fed. And if they give you something, they want something. And they always want more than what they gave you. Are you hearing what I'm saying? And so most of the music that you hear is coming from the water. Most of the fashion is coming from the water. Let me, let me, let me help y'all. A majority of those porn stars are from the water. There are, there, now I'm going to go deep. I'm, 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 the goal is to just destroy you. I'm going to destroy you. I'm destroying you tonight. Should make you want to pray. There are people that's not even people. There are people that are not people. There are people that are born in the water spirit, in the water kingdom, and can come here and come and walk amongst us and do the dirty deeds. And most of them are into pornography and prostitutes. Because those are the things that, that steal men's souls faster than anything else. And that's why some brothers, when they was with certain women, especially when they were with a prostitute, they see that when they realized that was my downfall. Because she done captured your soul. Not only did she capture, she take your soul and your sperm. Take it to the kingdom and make makeup out of it. Y'all ain't ready. I'm just trying to see. I'm, 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 I'm going to blow your mind to get y'all to understand there's a whole other world that y'all don't know is out there. And all of this fashion with everything, with these yoga pants and everything popping out, it comes from there. That's where it comes from. Because the whole goal is lust, to put lust in the hearts of men so that men will lust. Are y'all there? Are y'all there? That's why the Bible says a man commit adultery, his life will be reduced to a slice of bread. That's the goal, to reduce your life to zero. Are y'all there? Can we keep going? An, a, another job of water spirits is to rob you. They rob you of your poverty. They make you into poverty. They actually steal your money. They st <laughs> I know it's all of y'all believe it. They actually steal your money in the spirit world. They steal your money. They trade your money. Witch is stuff, you trade, take your people's money, trade and spend it in the spirit world. There are markets in the sea. There's all kind of stuff. It's like cities. A greatest understanding, I'm gonna give y'all, I'm gonna give y'all a great understanding. I know it's gonna be kind of funny, kitty, but a great understanding of what I'm talking about is SpongeBob. Cities under the sea. Whole cities under the sea in the marine kingdom. I know you don't want to believe it, but that's all right. I ain't got I ain't I ain't, you know, you know, I'm a preacher and I'm going, but those that are battling though. 
those that are battling know. And so there are, there are cities under the sea. And so what they do is, is they rob you of your, they take your wealth. And that's why a person be ready to go for a promotion, boom, something bad happened, car wreck, accident. They, soon they get ready to try to get up, they keep you down. Usually if you have sex with that spirit, the, they'll come the day before you're about ready to get a job or some type of deal or promotion, something coming through, and then if you have sex with them, it'll destroy that. The next day that'll be destroyed. They come on the edge of breakthrough. Y'all heard what I'm saying? 